TNT2 software is a fantastic practicing tool for musicians. Let's check it out. All right, so we have the TNT2 software here opened up. Um, it automatically gives you this prompt to select your book below. Let's select Alfred's Basic Rock Guitar. Automatically it brings up track one. Let's just select the track here, track 86. Now press play, let's check it out. On the top far right is your master volume. You can move that down, get the right level. And you'll see six different channels. I can move down the drums or the bass and really select the exact mix I want. But since I want to play the part written in the book, it's the guitar part, I can hit the solo button and just hear that part alone. Once I get it down, instead of listening to that part, I can actually mute it. So now I'm hearing everything else except for the guitar so that I'm playing with the band. Another great feature is you can make the tempo go faster or way slower. And the pitch does not change. If you like the pitch to change, maybe to play in a different key, you can just change the pitch um, buttons by pressing on the plus or minus to play in a different key. The last feature I want to show you guys is the looping feature. If there's a section of the song that's kind of difficult, you can click on the waveform and highlight it, then press play. That's going to loop that section around over and over again so you can work on it and get it perfect. If you have any other questions, you can go to the question mark down here and click on that for help and that will take you to alfredmusic.com where there's a whole bunch of additional information. Alright, so those are some of the fun features that are in TNT2 software.